my god as soon as it hit the water what the oh shit. all right y'all basically to catch your your bait here there's a bluegill you can go to pretty much any walmart grab yourself a pole some line if it doesn't already have it and some tiny little hooks like this put some bread on it cast her out once you caught your fish Get them off the hook, and you come over here to your bigger pole. I like to do it on the back side, right about there. And now you're catching biggins. Usually, I like to keep my bobber like a foot or so away from my bluegill, keep them out of the weeds. We are just going to toss him out there. That way I have bait out there while I'm catching more. And hopefully we get something. We spotted a bass. Will he stay there? Will he stay there? And is he big enough to eat this? Is he still there? He's still there. He's still there. Way beyond. Creep up on it. No, he's swimming away. No. This is what we come for. Beautiful peacock bass. There's tons of them in here. And they're going crazy for the bluegill. I don't know what's out there, but it's taken my bait twice and got away. Let's see if I'll bite the third one. You got it all on tap. I'm loving your vibe. Always have your back. We like our same tracks. Listen all night. No! God. As soon as it hit the water, what the? Oh, my boy swallowed it. Nice. <laughs> Finally started hitting it, bruh. About time. on the board that man swallowed it completely all right we just threw our last bluegill out uh, i just wanted to take this time to make some final comments one gotta record more because a few of the bluegill that i had the bass weren't that big but it was still some catches i could have shown you guys um and Another thing that I noticed is you don't have to always cast your live bait way out into the deep on the lake. You can actually cast it right on that line where like before it gets, starts to drop off. Because the more you think about it, the more it's common sense. The bluegill hang out in the shallow areas. So like even though like your instinct would be to cast it out for those bigger, deeper fish, that sometimes they come up too and they will attack a bluegill in the shallows. So I thought that was pretty cool. I caught a few like that. Um, but I think that's gonna do it for this video. So thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.